Hello people of the internet, my name is Esther and today I have a Easter themed video for you guys. I have one DIY and two outfits for you guys. I originally planned on doing a separate DIYs and outfits video but at the moment I'm writing a very big paper to get my diploma by the end of the semester and yeah work just got piled up. So sadly I'm only going to be doing one video instead of two. Nonetheless, I hope you guys really enjoy this video and get some inspiration for things to do or outfits to wear. For the DIY portion, we're going to make a sequin egg. You're going to need polystyrene eggs, I think that's how you pronounce it. Um, you're going to need sequins and some pins. Lots of pins. I actually ended up using up the whole box here, so you need a lot. If your sequins came on a string like mine did, you're gonna have to remove them from the string. This is very time consuming, so I would recommend buying them not on a string. Now that you have all of your colors laid out, we're gonna get started. So first, take a pin, take a sequin, and just pin it into the egg. The whole thing's very simple. It takes some time to cover the whole egg, and you can have fun with switching up the colors and making up patterns. So mine's going to be flower pattern. So while I'm doing that, I'm gonna actually talk to you guys a little bit about a Hungarian tradition. On Easter Monday in Hungary, we have a tradition where the guys go and sprinkle the girls with water to keep them fresh, as if women are flowers. Um, when the actual tradition started, the guys went with a bucket of water. Um, nowadays it's very rare and people don't do that for fun, so instead of a bucket of water, guys use some sort of perfume or cologne. In exchange for the sprinkling, the girls are supposed to give out eggs, preferably painted red, but nowadays it's common to give out chocolate eggs or sometimes even money. Me and my mom try to keep it interesting, so we always try to find something new to make because we're quite crafty. So let's speed up the things a little bit. After uh, you laid out your pattern you can start filling in the empty spaces. I went with green for half of the egg and for the other half I went with blue. You guys can obviously do this as a decorational item. You can make a basket full of them and put them out on the table but for me it's for giving it away. Okay, so now let's move on to the next portion, which is the outfit. Running in the sand, living on the land. The salty breeze was in our eyes. We stood beneath the dragonflies and danced all night. We polished all the chrome. Rusty little home. We slept all night in parking lots. We tied our hearts in double knots so tight. So free. So So long ago, with whiskey and an afterglow, we shine. Light. 